the federal government electricity tariff hike and removal of subsidies from the power sector. Now, uh, the NLC and its leaders argue that the reversal of the hike has become sacrosanct due to the nation's economic state. Workers were criticized for being the worst affected by the hike and they called for NLC to focus on regulations rather than anti people policies. This is all President Tinubu to reverse the hike. Rather than increasing the electricity tariff, we are saying that Nigeria should not be shortchanged. This unbearable uh, 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 um, policy should be stopped. Nigeria should be allowed to breathe. Enough is enough. We reject this totally. Nigeria should not suffer for the inefficiency of our leader. They should concentrate on distributing electricity and power to all co electricity consumers. And the argument is that if the tariff, if those customers on band A tariff is increased, they will enjoy electricity for more than 20 hours per day. Is this possible in this Nigerian day? Electricity is no longer supplied to the consumer. Yet they are increasing the tariff. They are saying that 15 percent of the consumer are on this band A. Should the remaining 75 percent suffer? Should the 15 percent suffer for the inefficiency of our leader? That is why. The National Secretariat directed us to seal up all the distributing company in Nigeria, all the Nigerian Electricity Regulation Commission in Nigeria, and all their offices. Enough is enough. That using this opportunity to express our displeasure and to tell the, our national I mean, our president, Ashwa Jumola Metinubu, as he has reverted that issue of cyber security levy, he should also compel. Nigerian Electricity Regulatory Commission to do the same. Is, uh, what you are saying, they should revert back to the price we are paying. They must, there mustn't be any increase in electricity tariff. That is, that is, that is, that is the simpler demand we are, we are requesting. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.